Welcome to Cooking for Baby and Me. Today's featured ingredient are zucchinis, and we'll be making zucchini fries and zucchini pad thai with carrots, ginger, cucumbers, radish, and toasted almonds. Joining me in our Morris Black Kitchen is Dr. Jennifer Janko from St. Luke's University Health Network and Chef Lee Chismar. We're gonna just jump right in uh, with the zucchini fries. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this up. And you can kind of cut these in whatever shape you want. Um, I usually go a little bit thinner so they kind of cook up a little bit quicker. Mm -hmm. okay. So for, for this, you're basically going to go flour into the egg wash. We have panko breadcrumbs. Okay. Uh, and then we're going to do a, a double breading on the panko. I think I'm doing pretty good here. <laughs> So what are you some of the nutritional, nutritional values of zucchini? Zucchini is kind of your workhorse of a vegetable. You're getting lots of different kinds of vitamins in there. You're getting vitamin A, you're getting potassium, some vitamin C, some antioxidants. And they help with the lots of different functions of the body. So it's going to work, like I said, with your immune system. Calcium you always need for healthy teeth and for healthy bones. Um, you've got the antioxidants, so that's good in the short term. Um, certainly good in the long term for your long term health. It's these fries, I think, are going to be liked by many in the family. For sure. What are we doing over here? Okay, so I went ahead and just sliced up some zucchini. So even here I have a little bit of cauliflower. Okay. What I'll usually do is I actually just kind of go right to town. I'll do it with broccoli. Here I'm just going to slice. These are actually daikon radishes, and this okay. is just going to be for garnish at the end. Uh, these are the black radishes mm -hmm. uh, that really have that nice I black seen skin. I have that one before. And can you eat the skin on those? You can eat the skin on them. I really like to just kind of cut them up really thin. That gives us some really yeah. great color. So let's go ahead and you can just kind of start dropping these guys. Okay. And how right. long do they typically cook for? So really this is, is probably three to five minutes. And so I'll go ahead and leave this to you guys. Okay, great. Um, so as you're cooking, you're just going to use your uh, tongs to kind of rotate them around. Okay. You just really want them beautiful golden brown. And what kind of oil are you cooking this in? Um, so this is actually a blended canola and olive oil blend. So over yeah. here now, I have GGS or ginger scallion garlic, mm -hmm. um, and I'm going to go ahead and add this to it. I actually do a little shallot in there also. Here I have an egg white that okay. I'll drop this okay. in. So that was a little fish sauce uh, and rice wine vinegar, equal okay. parts. All right, so these are our rice noodles. We literally, you, you get these, you soak them in hot water for 10 minutes and they're ready to go, which is really Okay, good. that's really, really easy. Yeah. Um, I'm going to go ahead and sprinkle some almonds into right. this. Sometimes what I'll do is I'll take a little vegetable stock or, or whatever we have just to kind of break down the noodles a little bit, kind of it wake it so up. Good. So next, really good. I'm just going to do a little cucumber for garnish. And what I do is I just take a spoon oh, and so kind of scrape out the seeds. Okay. So I think we're ready to go here. I'm just going to go ahead okay. and add a little fresh ingredients. I have a little cilantro here. I love oh, cilantro. Yes. It's my favorite garnish. And I have a little pea shoots. Okay. I have a little bit of scallion. And I'm just going to add a little bit of lemon juice to here. So usually when I do this, I'll come in and I like to actually kind of grab the noodles first. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And our final little touch is I just take a little cucumber. We'll kind of put that on top. That's a little bit amazing. of our radish. Oh, and, and it was so easy. Done in about five minutes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's take this and, and just kind of stack them. Mm -hmm. Gorgeous. So why don't we start with the zucchini fries? OK. How'd I do? What do you guys think? Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Very good. I love these. Nice and crunchy. And I think kids will love them too. Forget mm -hmm. about me loving them. Let's try the pad thai. That's incredible. So flavorful. It's really good. Packed with flavor. Mm -hmm. I love it. So delicious. Absolutely. Thank you so much.